Um, I came to Grandview one Tuesday evening because I was having chest pains associated with some dry heaving. I didn't know what was going on. I just thought I was feeling puny. And it got worse as the night progressed a little and I started having sweats and all. So thank goodness Grandview Hospital is where it is because my wife drove me here, got to the ER, and within about five minutes, I coded on the table. Uh, with the skills of the doctors here and the grace of God, they got me back. So After we left the ER, I was taken back to a procedure room and Dr. Sass inserted three stents in my widow maker, as he called it. And this didn't happen to me overnight. It happened over an accumulation of time. So the main thing I've been focusing on is what I eat and mainly what I don't eat. Quit picking, lay off sugars and carbs, you know, bread's a thing we all love, but it's worth it. It's given me time and I'll follow that diet. Since I left the hospital, I've also started a cardio rehab here at Grandview. And because of that, I feel I am light years down the road from where I was that November night. I'm not looking back, I'm looking forward. I'm gonna be positive about this. Cause if I didn't have that heart attack, the next time I might not have made it. I feel like it's actually given me more time. Any way you look at it, I've had like 48 more days than I would have had I not gotten brought back. So I look at this as a positive thing, if you want to call it that, because I've changed my lifestyle. I've changed my, my nutrition things and I'm exercising and doing the right thing. I can't fix what's behind me, but I can help what's in front of me. And I think you got to get your mind right and focus and, and pray. That, that's good too, I, I firmly believe that. But again, with the skill of the people here, the treatment I've been given, the physical treatment as well as the emotional treatment, I'm just very positive about it, very grateful, and I feel I will do well as long as I do what I've been told.